It is a complex undertaking, of course, to design such a big turbine. We are part of history. It is really history in the making. My name is Christian Gerlo. I'm uh, the product owner for Offshore in uh, Vestas Power Solutions. To me, I, I, I have to say that I was so impressed when I saw the prototype Nacelle for the first time in Linneu. It's so many different parts that are coming together there. A lot of people have been working on the V236 15 megawatt for actually for more than, than two years. We've been doing engineering and design and calculations. But now we are seeing that physical live product and, and we'll, we'll start to test it and, and get some real life experience with it. My name is Anders Jensen. I'm a project portfolio lead specialist within manufacturing. Having seen the Nacelle on drawings on a computer for the past couple of years, we know this would be big. But seeing it in actual real life, everything here is just bigger. So we have the steel structure of the nacelle, which is like the skeleton. Inside the skeleton, we have the main components of the nacelle being the gearbox, the generator, and our main bearing arrangement. My name is Anna Vidl, and I'm the SVP of Product Solution and Integration. It is a complex undertaking, of course, to design such a big turbine, and it requires that everybody are communicating a lot, collaborating, and also have a lot of passion to make sure they troubleshoot as we, as we of course see obstacles on the way. For the side compartments, we have worked a lot on modularization and standardization towards industry practices. And one of the good examples is that the size of the compartments actually fit very well with the supply chain requirements. They are very easy to transport both on trucks and, and on, on ships. The V236 15 megawatt is actually also one of the first manifestations of uh, Vesta's modular approach to product development. Modularization enables us to reuse our design across system level, component level and subcomponent level, hereby making sure that when we are designing a new turbine, we can rely on our designs and systems already in place and the supply chain setup we already have, instead of having to redesign everything and create a new infrastructure. My name is Jesper Oot. I'm Senior Director in Test and Verification. The testing we are doing is based on several years of experience. We started this testing journey uh, already 15 years ago, and of course that has built a lot of knowledge into our test protocols. The importance of testing is extreme on this turbine because it will be in the offshore environment. And of course, we need to be sure that it can actually last for the lifetime of the turbine. That's what brings certainty into Vestas, but of course also brings certainty into our customers that this turbine is the right solution for them. Once again, Vestas is taking a very big step forward for the wind industry. We're leading the way into this super-sized segment of wind turbines. We are preparing for the energy transition, will be a very big part of it. So it's a, it's a massive undertaking. We are hosting a very large project and seeing so many skilled people working relentlessly to make this happen really, it really makes me extremely proud and humble. It's a, it's a first step on offshore becoming an even more important part of the global energy system. It's an important contribution from Vestas to the energy transition. I don't like to use big words, but I think we are part of history. It is really history in the making. 